to see what do you mean by valid and invalid formulae, uh, satisfiable and unsatisfiable formulae, and falsifiable and unfalsifiable formulae. Let us see this simple terminology. Uh, it is nothing new, but uh, still important. Now we know that every formula can fall into one of the three categories. It can be always true or it can be always false or it can be sometimes true and sometimes false. We know that always true this category of the formula is called as tautology. Sometimes true, sometimes false, this category is called as contingency or contingent formulae. And always false, this type of formulae are called as contradictions. Now, a formula which is always true is also called as a valid formula. Otherwise, it is called as an invalid formula. So, these two things, okay, this will be called as valid and this entire category will be called as invalid. Okay, so uh, if a formula is tautology, it will be called as valid, otherwise it will be called as invalid. Now, we can see that both contingency and contradiction can be called as invalid formula. The second, uh, a formula which can be made true is called as a satisfiable formula. Now we know that tautologies are always true and contingency is true at least once. So contingencies can be made true and tautologies are always true and therefore they can be satisfied. And here we will say that tautologies and contingency together are called as satisfiable and contradictions can never be made true and that is why they are called as unsatisfiable formula. And after this we have falsifiable and unfalsifiable. A formula which can be made false is called as falsifiable, otherwise it is called as unfalsifiable. Now we know tautology is a category which can never be made false because it is always true and that is why this formula will be called as unfalsifiable and contingencies can be made false, similarly contradictions can also be made false, in, in fact contradictions are always false. You need not make them false, by default they are always false. So, a formula which can be made false is called as a falsifiable formula. Okay. So, likewise you need to remember this, uh, this terminology. Tautological formulae are called as valid, they are also called as unfalsifiable. Tautologies cannot be made false, that is why they are called as unfalsifiable. Contradictions are always false. They cannot be made true, they cannot be satisfied and that is why they are called as unsatisfiable. A formula which is not valid is called as invalid. A formula which is not tautology will be called as invalid. Therefore, contingencies are invalid and contradictions are also invalid. A formula which can be made true is called as satisfiable. That is why tautologies are satisfiable, contingencies are also satisfiable. Similarly, unfalsifiable and falsifiable. Contingencies, contradiction both can be made false and that is why they are called as falsifiable. Now, you can see that every contingency is invalid, every contradiction is invalid. An invalid formula may be contingency or it may be contradiction. Similarly, every contradiction will be unsatisfiable Every unsatisfiable formula will be called as contradiction. 
Similarly, a satisfiable formula will be either tautology or contingency. A tautology is always satisfiable, a contingency is always satisfiable. Similarly, a falsifiable formula can be either contingency or contradiction. A contingency is always falsifiable, a contradiction is always falsifiable. So you need to remember them categorically. So I hope you are very under, very clear with this particular diagram. And now, after this, we can make certain concluding statement. And what can be the concluding statements? They can be as follows. First, we can say tautology and contingencies are always satisfied. Okay. You can also say every tautology is satisfiable, is always satisfiable then contingency is always satisfiable satisfiable maybe a contingency maybe a tautology or contingency satisfiable cannot be contradiction and vice versa means a contradiction cannot be satisfiable. You cannot satisfy a contradiction. Then, contingencies is also falsifiable. Contradictions are also falsifiable. Then, a falsifiable formula may be a contingency or a contradiction. So, you need to remember the relationship between valid, invalid, satisfiable, unsatisfiable, falsifiable and unfalsifiable formulae. Thank you. We will stop.